tonight on Big Brother. Two new housemates. Right, right enough for me. Yeah. Oh, just got here yeah, too. I just got here did, you guys well? oh, did you? Yeah, yeah. And two more to come. Oh, he's yummy. <laughs> seven girls, seven guys. Let the games begin. Hey, I was just put off that he called me a bogan. Welcome to Big Brother. Tonight, the final two pieces of Big Brother's secret puzzle slot into place. The last male housemates will enter the compound. Who are they? And will the girls be able to pick their secrets? First though, let's catch up with the house. Uh, oh. no! 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 Another one! Ryan, I'm Bradley. Hey, Brad, nice to meet you, mate. Ryan. Hi, mate. Hey, nice mate. to meet you, dude. Welcome to the house. <laughs> Cheers, man. Housemate number 12, male model Ryan, enters the house. Joining you, boy, George, a Western Australian electrician. George just got here, too. Yeah, got here. He goes, oh, did you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You're a bit. There's no shortage of volunteers to take Ryan on a house tour and find him a bed. Um, no, Zoe's there. I'm there. Bradley's there. Michael's there. So that's all gone. Angie's, <laughs> Angie's there, that's Estelle's there, there. Oh, oh, Stacey's there, <laughs> yeah. and I believe Ryan is here. <laughs> Ryan seems, he's 21, he's a 21 year old dude. What 21 year old dude has any idea of what they're doing? Stacey is uh, making vocal an obvious sort of design about Ryan that everyone else is sort of being really subtle about. Like Estelle and Angie will be like, oh. You know, did you see him without his shirt off? Whereas Stacey will go lie on his bed and be like, oh, maybe we could do some chest press ups or something. I do, I hold an exercise class in the morning. What, 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 what stuff have you been doing? Like yoga? Oh, or I've just been Pilates. doing like these ones. <clears throat> like you get your go like this. What, in the bedroom? No, on the grass. Yeah. And then I just sort of get my hands to. <laughs> And then I just go like that. One. One. And then I just do one. And then, and then I just go onto the side. And then I go like that. And then one like that. And so I'm like a giant Pilates so ab, machine. Ab workout. <clears throat> See, I don't know if you know, so these are actually abs of steel under here. I just I cover yeah. it because I don't want to intimidate anyone. Like oh, any okay. models, you know? Shut up. I don't want to intimidate Man. anyone. What's, what's that guy with the long hair's name? George, again? the one that came in. No, not George, the other Michael. guy. Michael. Michael with the yeah. beard. Yeah. He's such a smart ass before. He's like, <laughs> yeah, so what do, you, yeah, what, do you, what do you do for work? And I'm like, oh, I'm a model. And then as soon as I walk up to the girls, she's like, oh, so just tell the girls, you know, oh, tell, yeah. tell the girls what, what you do. Like, I know. Don't worry, don't nah, worry about it. It's that. funny, it's funny. Nah. Layla could possibly have something later on. Just put it out there. She, from, from, from her past boyfriends that she's told me, Seems like they're part douche, part gym, part hair gel, sort of. They seem to fit a mould. That's Michael's hot tip. Uh, put it in at about seven to one. Alcohol involved, put it down to five, five to one. Layla had her rollers in when Ryan and George arrived. She's convinced one of them is the millionaire. Yeah, just hair, your hair looks gorgeous. Is it? Yeah, it looks stunning. Oh, one sec, no. Um, ooh, ooh. Up in there, it's like I'm sweating. Well, it's like off. a full on made an effort now, doesn't it? I'm like. Maybe it's. No, a bit... everybody knew you had your rollers in. We might get you a millionaire yet. Put in? A little millionaire. Oh, it looks like because I've picked millionaire that I want to be, want to get a millionaire, but. Be no, nice. but if there's a nice guy with a million dollars in his pocket, you wouldn't say no. Josh is giving checkout chick Bradley a lesson on how to check out chicks. All right, step one. <laughs> Don't stare too long. Okay. Right. It's just, just like the sun. Sneak, you can like glance. Sneak a glance and, and, and pretend that you didn't mean to. Oh, so just sit here like this and go, oh, wow, oh. oh. Oops. No, you just need, and then and then about a minute later, just sort of give it like I don't know somebody said something. You just give it, yeah. No, yeah. no, no, no. <laughs> it's got to be in a smooth movement, and you've got to be able to look away at something that's Hang actually on. happening. Bradley, did I just take my underpants off you in front of you for the first time? What happened? It's like apparently she took her underpants off. I didn't notice. Oh, you took your undies off next to him? No, just then. Oh, just then. 
Rookies. You were too busy making me look at her. Rookies. I'm picking up everything. Come here, come here. Are we going halvesies? Jump in. Big brother. Where do we look? Oh, hello, big brother. Hi, we just thought we'll come in and say hello. Um, house is cool, people are cool. So yeah, just thought we'll come and say hello. How do you feel you're fitting in in these early stages? I feel like I'm the new kid at school or like I just started a job. I just can't wait to see what happens later tonight, maybe. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't know. There's a couple of uh, really nice people I think I get along with, so. The girls are arguing um, wh where I'm sleeping. <laughs> I might just sleep by myself, big brother, in a double bed, if that's okay by you. I think there is actually a couple of spare beds. Yeah. Yeah, I got the corner one, I was like, keep to the self. Where the you're like actually up? like this though, aren't you? Like, you're like a little bit gangster. Oh, Look at her, of, she's yeah, a whole lot gangster. One of the earliest pairings in the house is Estelle and Bradley. They've become inseparable. You live in love? You live in love? I live in large. Are you living large, y'all? I am large, let's make it. Okay, so not 270, but... I'm not nuts, I wanted to do something like that. I thought, it's a pizza. Sorry, man. I want to do it. Let's go crazy. Woo! Okay. Let's go join the group. Let's. Feels like it's such a huge group now. Let's. So that must mean we're going to get two more tomorrow. Maybe. Or will we get them tonight? Next up. Higher. Higher. Angie's worried that Bradley might get hurt. Isn't he the sweetest? Isn't he? He's so sweet. And he's so smart. Just be careful, though. I'll take you two over and show you the birds. We've got to feed the birds as well. <laughs> there are two fake birds perched on a backyard antenna. A perfect opportunity for Sarah to test George and Ryan on their secret. It's Alfie and Fred. Every now and then they come down and we have to feed them. I see now, I see. I'm pretty happy with the birds. I thought you said there were birds in here. I was like, look, I was like... No, it was a good joke though, because you're like the other <laughs> birds. I wouldn't mind seeing the birds. Yeah, I, know, yeah. I hate birds. Do you? I understand. Why I do birds. you? Is there a reason? That's, oh, I can't stand birds. Why? I don't like them. That's one of my biggest like, phobias of fears. Birds. Really? Yeah. Because I, I don't know why. It sounds stupid, right? But just Chips. the beak and like they can sense my fear and just... Crash! Like, like, really? Yeah, don't like them. Okay. There you go. Do you know? Yeah. Um, what? No, nothing, nothing. You can tell me, Ryan. <laughs> Ryan. I did oh, make up that we had to I feed the birds. You, Ryan, Ryan, Ryan. I did make up we had to feed birds. I was just saying I don't like birds. Why? They feed the top. Why? <laughs> Why? I just anything with actual two legs is fine, but just yeah. like no. <laughs> I think Estelle that I Talks should have Bradley. a pair of your shoes on. Bradley has befriended Estelle and is spending a lot of time with her. I really think this Pine look action. is like Pine working action. for me. Higher, higher. Yeah. Oh. You were, whoa, that was good. Yeah. I go to the bathroom. So we're gonna need to go to the bathroom. I'm going to toilet too. Okay. Cool. Damn. Yeah, I'm, just, yeah, I'm just cruising. For a bruising. <laughs> <laughs> you and Bradley are the cutest little friends. Isn't he the sweetest? Isn't he? He's so sweet. And he's so smart. Just be careful though. Oh really? No. Well, no. I'm just saying. See, see. Like you, you wait. Just talk to me. There's nothing. No, I. Is is it I want anything? Him to, I, no, I just want. Okay. Him to, I want him to feel comfortable. No, and no, I know no, that I'm he feels saying, comfortable like, talking I'm, to me. I'm just thinking out loud. Do it. Um, if I was to think out loud, it would be. Continue to think out he's, loud. Well, I'm he's he's young. He's yes. a virgin. Yes. And he's he's looking for his place to fit in and everything, which is great. So no, 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 which is great because you got this great friendship, mm. but you just need to reiterate. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Friends, yeah, yeah fist pump. I think yeah, tomorrow friends. if it can, if it can, if he. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This um, is Big Brother. No, it isn't. Who is it? It's Female it's housemates to the parlor. Oh! The parlor is the only place the girls can discuss the boys' secrets. It's like a girly room. <laughs> hey, you figured one out, <laughs> didn't you? I cannot believe it. <laughs> he admitted to being scared of birds. No, I reckon that's a playoff. Do you reckon he's still the no, no. no. 
arrogance true? Because he went and talked to Big Brother after he dropped it really Nah, he's not. Yeah, me too. No, I don't reckon he is. I reckon he's still with 100 women. He's doing the bird thing to show it off. Look at Brad getting ready. A call to the parlour can also mean another housemate is coming in. So how you finding it, dudes? Yeah, not bad, not bad. I swear, oh man, when I first walked in, I was flipping out. This is like a microphone. You can. Sing what Fantastic. you can say. Fantastic. No, but sing it's okay. It, I'm going to pass it on. <laughs> I just want to say, George, he's definitely not a millionaire because he works for a company as an electrician. Ah, yeah. oh, wait, wait, wait. Electricians in the mines, if he's been working there for four years, he could have made a million dollars. That's if he hadn't spent a, a penny mm. in a day. And not over. They make and up to 400 over. grand a year. Yeah? But that, no. so... Basically, you would have to spend nothing. Go. I think he's dated a lot of women. Go. Yeah. Who do you reckon Joshua hates? Who do I think's the hottest? It's weird. I might go Angie because I reckon she's probably. Probably. just rock. Sarah's pretty attractive. Yeah. Sarah's hot. Yeah, I think Sarah's a bit of a bad. But like, too. Sarah looks exactly like my. Is that the cowboy hat one? Yeah. yeah. She's got a boyfriend though. Yeah. Oh, actually, I didn't know that. Do you think, given that Ryan is a model, the polar opposite is him having an IQ of a genius, considering he's done a law degree, commerce yeah, degree? No. He's done a commerce and law no, degree. No, he's the bird boy. And he <laughs> likes watching exercise. <laughs> Are we sure he's a bird boy? At the same time, I, like, I'm doing a double major in a degree and I'm not a genius, and I think... I think at the end of the day, anyone can do a degree. Yeah. Um, you know, he's he's a model, et cetera, et cetera. He's already said he has a phobia of beds. I'm guessing he's the one, but yeah. let's just play it out and see if anyone else. Whatever you do in life, it's just a pursuit of getting a girl <laughs> and finding a more attractive one. That's basically it. It's like, why did you get a job in law? It's like, well, you hear tricks like money. And <laughs> I had no job. Ryan is like a proper English lad to me. Like, he reminds me of an English lad. He's a lad. Like, He's like a proper English really? lad. He's a yeah, lad. He yeah, he's an English He lad. reminds me of an English That's why I'm like, oh, oh, I just talked to him because he reminds me of it. Because he, like, you might think he's like touchy feely or whatever, but lads in England are just like, oh, no, yeah. Come on, darling. That's Sorry, can I say something? Let, let, let it go. Let's let it go. What I was going to say is that I hope George is the one who's dated more than 100 women because I would like to be 101. Oh. <laughs> Coming up. Are you nervous? Oh, that's all I've been thinking about. Hey, I'm just trying to work it out in my head. Sonia sneaks into the house to send in housemate number 13. I'm in the camera run with housemate number 13. So let's find out a little bit more about him. If I set a goal, I stick with it. One of my goals is to get on Big Brother. Look at me right now. I can't think of a single goal that I haven't achieved. Being a vet is great. It's extremely stressful, but I'm constantly busy. I don't take lunch breaks. I just work, 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 work. I'm looking forward to Big Brother because it's gonna be, it's like rehab for a workaholic, you know? I like to be very assertive. I pull somebody aside. I say, this is what you're doing. This is why you're in the wrong, why I'm in the right, and this is why it needs to stop. No. Outside of the Big Brother house, it usually ends in this. Inside the Big Brother house, God knows. <laughs> Very nice. Being a perfectionist isn't easy. And here he is. Now, Ray, you've been in lockdown. Mm. You don't know who's gone into the house or what they've been up to. Does that make you nervous? Uh, I'm a little bit anxious about it. It's definitely making me go stir crazy, so. Well, you know, they have been forming some friendships mm. in there. Does that worry you? Uh, yeah, it's going to be a bit of a challenge, but I'm definitely confident enough to step up to it. Well, hopefully you'll make some new friends in there. Yeah. Time to go. All right, cheers. Good, good luck. Thank you. Good luck. We'll be watching. OK. Shh. Shh. Some... <laughs> <laughs> Michael? That's Tell the bedroom. Hey, guys, yeah. sorry I'm late. Oh! Yeah, yeah! Oh, Jesus, Just hallelujah. Give me some love. How are you, dude? Very good, mate. Very good. What's up? How are you, brother? I'm Bradley. Bradley, love to meet you, mate. How about Ryan? Ryan, nice love you, mate. Huh? Yeah, Josh. 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 Nice hair, bro. Hey, mate. Josh. Where are all the chicks at? Me. They're in the parlour, bro. Oh, okay, that's cool. Oh, millionaire. He's so cocky. Yeah. 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 So cocky. We got some drinks. What's going on? No, no drinks. No drinks. Really? Okay, that's cool. Vet. Vet? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
He's either, no, you know what? He's either IQ or millionaire nah. because he's talking down. He's talking There's no down. way he's that he's a hundred women. He's but a jerk cannot date a hundred women. It's a big vet. Yeah, yeah. So this is a bit different for me. What, you can care what about the, the fish. Mexican, fish Mexican in the house. walking yeah, fish. Yeah, so that's all. Yeah, what we well, well, think it's a water fish. An aquarium. Yeah, it's like a tropical aquarium. Show it to me. Come on, Ray. Can you tell us what type of fish it is? Yeah, can you tell you us? Know, I'm just going to go with puffer fish uh, on this one. Yeah, well, I mean, tetradont, we'll call it a tetradont. What's a scientific name? Tetradont. 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 I've done a bit of biology. Did you? <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, please don't disprove me on that one. I think it's a tetradont. Uh, he could be a juvenile defender. He could yeah, be. Because completely the opposite to what he looks like. This so, is wait, so, so awesome. So, how many years did you have to study to become a vet? Uh, six long. I did like a year to upgrade. How many years did you have to study to become a model? <laughs> you Mate, know what's going on here. Kitchen. Those. Kitchen. I'm so glad that's caught off. <laughs> There's no chocolate milk. Uh, no, awesome. Yeah. Oh! 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 Do not he just slam the fridge. Do not put your Why hands you on our fridge. Get yeah, your fingers off our fridge. Yeah, I want yeah, chocolate milk. Crazy. I'll do anything for it. Oh. Mm -hmm. yeah. His big brother. Female housemates. Your time in the parlour oh. is up. Thanks, Big Brother. Thank, Thank you. you. We're going to get slowly because I still think we can't see them. Oh, really? Hi. Hi. Hello, hello, hello. Hi. Give us some love. Ray Ray. Oh. Ray Ray. How are you doing? Like everybody? a stingray. No, don't call hey. me that. I'm Estelle. Estelle, lovely to meet you. Hi, I'm Zoe. Zoe, lovely to meet you. Chanel. 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 The guy's oh, interested in his own yes. game. Then. Okay, yeah, I've got a bone to pick with him. Oh, do you? Oh, yeah. So press that button, and that'll open up, and you'll go left. To Good luck, soldier. Yeah. Cheers, bro. Ray. Big brother, how's it going, bro? Welcome. Thank you. That's a great welcome from me. Uh, just check the fridge, no chocolate milk, what's the story? All I want is syrup, I'll do anything for it. Set the challenge, it's done. I'll make my own chocolate milk. Your request has been noted. Ah, uh, cheers big brother, I love you mate. Ray. Yes? You may like to refrain from referring to big brother as mate. Oh, okay. Is that the way it's gonna be? Is there anything else? Nah, we're cool. See you, mate. See you, big brother. Yeah, that big one does Big brother it. is a b You're so mean. Oh, really? I was just like, hey, man, can you swing us a chocolate milk? He's, oh, he's like, like, do not call me man. I am not your mate. Oh, did he like, really say yeah. that to you? Brad, you won't lie, mate. Lying about what? Big brother. What about it? He's not a very friendly man. Next. Right. You're to go immediately to the naughty corner for calling Big Brother a naughty name. Just want to apologise for before. We obviously got off on the wrong foot, so I apologise. Are you feeling some remorse? I just want a beer, actually. Can I please have a beer? Oh, yeah, I'm feeling remorse as well. Ray, a short while ago, in the diary room, Big Brother requested you not to refer to him as anything other than Big Brother. However, you then left the diary room and referred to Big Brother using a naughty name. Ah, uh, I gotta get used to the fact you got cameras everywhere. <laughs> I apologize, I'm sorry. I, um, yeah, we got off on the wrong foot. I don't wanna have a bad relationship with you, Big Brother. 
I'm all into the bromance. So, uh, look, I apologize. If I could please have a beer, that'd be fantastic. You know, I really want to just crack a beer with these guys. They seem like heaps of fun and I would love to just have a beer with them. Yeah, and I'll, I'll refer to you as big brother. I'll give you the respect that you warrant. If you give me a beer. That is unfortunate. Ray, when you leave the diary room, you're to go immediately to the naughty corner for calling Big Brother a naughty name. Okay, cool. Your housemates will show you where it is. Cool. That is all. Uh, what about the beer? No? Okay, cool. Ray's been sent to the naughty corner! It's lit up! So what happens? I don't know! Uh, you said go to the naughty corner. Go stand next to the door! Okay. So what do I have to do? Just stand there. You two are going to be best friends! What happened? Ray, 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 Yeah. Ray, you must write the line, I must not call Big Brother naughty names 50 times on the blackboard. You may not leave the naughty corner until Big Brother is satisfied. That is all. I must not call Big Brother. This is Big Brother. Michael, you should have your microphone around your neck, not fellow housemates. He got too excited, he got so excited. He lucky he was standing really close to you. He's going to get in trouble as well. He's definitely going to get in trouble for that. Did he say anything after I ran off? Michael, as the naughty corner is in use, <laughs> drop and give Big Brother 50 push ups yeah! in the lounge. Come closer. Oh. That was so good. That was really clear. Letting all the chicks out there know what's up. <laughs> 50 times. Done. You said right on the chalkboard, I must not call Big Brother naughty names 50 times. Oh! He looks like he's gonna spit it. He's gonna, he's gonna crack. He's gonna crack. Look at him. He looks so happy. Oh no! Yeah, yeah. Why would you do that? Give it to me, big brother. Just do it. No, don't do that. You've already done like thirty. You just keep going. I was up to twenty. I couldn't do it. Twenty. my head. Just keep going. No. What? He'll give me this one. I don't think he will, Ray. Just do it, man. You know he's not going to talk to you until you do the 50 lines. I, I just did it. That's oh. what he asked me to do. No. He's not going to say just, anything. Just, he's not going to answer you. You're just sitting there all night. Wait it out, Ray. Wait it out. Be strong, brother. Solidarity. Be strong, Ray. <laughs> Unity. You can do it. Or don't, don't, don't buckle, Ray. Don't buckle. Don't buckle. Don't buckle. Don't buckle.
right. To the man right. Be a man right. Be a man right. You're going to have to. Right. We'll give it I reckon you've got to ride it. All right, let's get serious. Radio. Won't admit when he's wrong. Hmm? What are we thinking? About what? Just the dynamico. Yeah, I, I feel Too like early to tell, Doc. Yeah, I think, I don't know, Ray's coming. It's a bit, a little bit of something to prove. He walked in with swag, eh? Yeah, he walked in, he's like, sorry, I'm late, boys. Oh, really? And I was like, I'm just so tired really? by this point. I'm just like, hey. Did man. he actually, was that his opening line? Yeah. Oh, wow. Are you done? You done, Ray? It's all good. This I is Big Brother. I'll, be, I'll have to look a little bit for him. Ray. Yes. Your penmanship is borderline illegible. Ah! Where's Michael? I gave him my best shot. He's a vet. He's However, a... on this occasion, mm. Big Brother is satisfied. Uh, Thank you, oh, Big yeah. Brother. You may leave the naughty corner. Okay. That is all. Did you hear? I heard so, what my brother said. No. I know this is passing judgment. I've tried not to, but like, he comes out. Yeah. Ray, okay, so Ray, Ray comes out and um, they go, oh, you know, what did you say? And he goes, oh, I can't even remember. And I said, oh, no, you can remember. You just don't want to repeat it. And he goes, well, look, it really wasn't that bad. Bit, an, bit of an overreaction. But okay, big brother, we get it. All hail, big brother. I was like, oh. <laughs> like oh. dude, you're going to get yourself in so much in here. Coming up, the final housemate reveal. Oh, he's so cute! Yes. Yes. I'm back at the house with the 14th and final housemate, so let's find out all about him. So, my friends would say that I was incredibly opinionated. I'm the bitchiest person you'll probably ever meet. <laughs> I tell people secrets. And I hate people that when you're telling stories, they've got a me too story. But I am that person because most of the time, it's actually happened to me. But it's so important to be happy and it's very easy to be upset and it's very easy to be sad, but it's more important to find yourself. If I don't like someone, they will know pretty much straight away about how much I hate them, unless I don't want them to know and I'm manipulating them. I don't like people that are liars either. So I think it's important for me to be as honest and as real as I possibly can. So you spend all day, you're an account manager, you're on the phone. How's yeah. it been not having a phone to um, even talk to people? And how will you go in the house with no phone? Uh, I'm actually looking forward to not making any calls for work. Having a little time off. Enjoying the break. Well, how, how much of a break do you think you'll have? How long do you think you'll be in the house? Uh, judging by how much I don't know right now and how much I haven't known for the last 10 days, mm -hmm. I'm going to say I know nothing. This is the most amount of nothing I've ever known. Right. Good. <laughs> Excellent. We've achieved something there, haven't we? Most amount of nothing. Yeah. So, your secret. What yeah. is it? Uh, I can't tell you. I can't tell anyone. All right, good. You passed that test, so yeah. I guess you can go into the house. <gasps> Do you want to go? I'm excited! Yeah. Thank, you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Good luck. See you later. Bye. Bye. Last housemate. Gone. Nice to meet you, dude. Nice to meet you. Hi. Hey, how you going, oh, mate? We got a bit of a Our little family's complete. Oh, no. I haven't had a girlfriend since I was 11. Oh. Oh. Obviously, you're the youngest person here. I am the youngest. I'm 18. Yeah. Oh, my God. How old are you? Um, oh, how old do you think I am? Such a gay thing to say. Oh, sure. <laughs> 23. 27. 28. Um, 27. 
27? No, 28. I am the oldest contestant, I think, here. 33. Really? Nearly. 32. 32. 32. 33. Nearly. Oh, yeah. You're the oldest contestant. 32. I like this guy. I like him a lot. If we find out he's straight, are we going to hate him? Like, I'm going to love him. Can <laughs> <laughs> yeah. love it even more? Oh. I will. Who's yeah. The this is my Simba doll. Love the Lion King. <laughs> See? Oh my god. And that's my bra. I need a little bit of support. <laughs> so, it's hey. my Simba doll. I was like, yes. The funniest thing in the history of the world. I have no idea. This is oh, so weird. Good. No, no. The girls are just somewhere. Are they? Are the girls fun? Uh, yeah. yeah. They They're a riot. They, they, they are. I have a feeling that you and Stacey are just going to get on like a house. Because she yeah, is just the most fantastic girl in the world. So if you keep pigeonholing me as being gay, can I can pigeonhole you as being like a bogan because you've got weird hair? Oh! What bogan has hair like that, man? I'm that's still well, waiting to see that's what it looks after. Real. It's real. <laughs> it's real. Yeah, yeah. Bradley Stewart. This yeah, like... is Big Brother. Female housemates, your time in the parlour is up. Thanks, Big Brother. Thanks, Big Brother. Shall we? Let's show. Shall <laughs> Shanae, nice Shanae, lovely to meet you too. Wow. Look at all the filming. Yes. Welcome to the house of fun. Have you guys been having fun? Yes, yes. we have. You'd be loving that 50s kitchen over oh here, wouldn't God. you? Oh my God, love. I Seriously. don't know when to find Shanae. it. Is that for you? <laughs> um, maybe not, I doubt it. I, I doubt it. I think it fit in over there really well. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fabulous. Carl, it's really nice. Yeah, I can't wait to smell you. <laughs> you think I smell fabulous? <laughs> ben is yet to choose a bed, and Stacey and Estelle are both keen to help him out. So, I know where I'm sleeping. Say, but I know if my boyfriend's I, like going to be terrified that I that they're all double beds. Oh, come he's, sleep next to you, me. Yeah, I'll yeah, come and sleep over here. You should, you should just come here. I'm over here. here. Come here. So I so I can sleep here. Yeah. He's like this. He's like this. I know. Like we're this. pitting them all, aren't we? I'm just still upset about Ben. <laughs> it's alright. I'll get over it. I'll move on. Why are you upset? He called me a bogan. <laughs> I sometimes if people, if I'm a bit nervous, I can mm. be a little bit like, <sniffs> and mm. so I think I was a little bit cutting mm, to a few same. few people. <laughs> she called Michael a bogan. Oh, yeah. He's so upset about that. Really? He's like, you called me a bogan, you called me a bogan. And I'm like, oh gosh. Yeah. <laughs> You're not going to take that offensively? <laughs> yes, I am. No. I'm the opposite. No. I hate bogans. <laughs> No, you're I'm not a, a bogan. Thank you. I was, I was just being like, I was like, oh, you're going to love the girls there. And he's just like, oh, if we're making assumptions, then I guess you're the house bogan. And I'm just like, I'm like, oh, I'm your friend. I'm, I'm actually not the I'm one not that's going to have a problem. A jerk. I'm going to be a good one. When you have a whole group together, it's like, da, 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 voice against voice. On Everyone's person, trying to talk over the other people. Sort of some, I just sit there going, put my two cents in, surveyed. Yeah. Put and my then, two cents in. Surveyed. So. Oh. But I'm an extreme <coughs> social. Person. I'm more like, I'll put a dollar fifty in. <laughs> put another dollar fifty in, and then if you haven't heard me, another dollar fifty. <laughs> <Hello. laughs> Do you feel like um, dynamics going to change a bit? Yeah, yes. big time. But George would fit in naturally. He's so lovely. Yeah. Oh, he's George would be so, so cool. Lovely. And straight up, George he's would be so, so cool. lovely. But I feel like I sort of have to be on my guard a little bit with Ryan. Well, what's the other guy? You, got, you seriously got rattled by oh, Ray. 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 I think really? we really have to be really tight, touch around Ray because he like. I don't. I don't think, I think we need to make Ray's going to be really all interesting. I'm saying is I haven't so, made yeah. any assumptions, but all He's I'm saying is straight away. I said I'm not sure about Ryan. I'm not sure about Ray, but straight up. George could slip in and you wouldn't He's even so notice. He's so chill. Yeah. Sat there and told a joke. Give him like I would have been yeah. like way embarrassed Excuse me. away. It's all right. Can we kiss and make up? I'm so sorry that I called you a bogan. <laughs> it's all right. I'm just like the anti-bogan. I'm like, oh god. No, 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 no. Look, can I just say? Sometimes I was just explaining this before. When I'm in a situation that when well, I'm a bit anxious. And I don't yeah, you must have been pretty then I, When anxious, I walked yeah. in, everything about me was about me being gay when I first walked in. I didn't want to make and that. I, I didn't say anything. No, no, no. I, I'm certainly not saying that to you, but I'm just saying, like, for me, I, can imagine I consider be being gay about the fifth and the sixth thing that's interesting about me. But then I found that it was interesting oh, that I, I was living the overalls up to it. first. Yeah, the overalls. That was like, there's a guy in overalls. That's the first, obviously. <laughs> well, please accept my No, apology. that's okay. I was just a little, oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, oh, man, it cut me deep. Because she's like, you know what, it's okay. 
Coming up, Michael's suspicions about one of the new housemates. I just think he's lying about something or he's hiding something. I just get, I just get that feeling. Tonight's Big Brother, brought to you by the Holden Cruise, the only small car built in Australia. This is Big Brother. Is it Sassy Boy? George and Benjamin to the diary room. You're gonna get your luggage, you're gonna get your luggage. Maybe, maybe. The four new male housemates haven't yet been given their luggage, which had to be checked by Big Brother. Housemates. Hello? As you can see, Big Brother has provided your luggage. We can see that, yes. You're free to take this inside the house. Could you take your fellow housemates' luggage inside as well, please? Sure. No worries. Have you felt welcomed? Yeah, definitely. I felt welcomed. I'm, I think at the moment it seems like we're all really big, happy families. I think it's going to be interesting to watch that dynamic change. I can already tell from some of the people that I've met that they're going to get on my nerves a little bit. So, I don't know. Some of the girls are like staring at me or treating me like a bit of a novelty. And that's, I don't know, I don't know. It's foreign to sort of be treated like a, an accessory or like that these people know who I am just based on the fact that I'm a bit shiny and gay and wearing nice clothes. <laughs> I don't know, like I just felt like I got labelled really quickly and that doesn't bode well with me. Yeah, I reckon it was a bit different how we were just like the new kids on the block, you know, like everyone already gelled with each other and we just come in midway through. Yeah, it's different, but yeah, we'll get there. So you basically like turned gay? I haven't turned gay, I was always but gay. You are always gay, but you were with women? Yeah. So was there, you know, like a point when you're like, that girl was so wrong and then like turned to a guy? Like was there this like, you know, like, a girl that like turned you completely I'm and gonna just made say, you be like... Remember when you're 18? I didn't go through puberty until I was 18. Really? 11. So when I was 18, I was yeah, 11. Beard, hair, hi. 13. I was 18. So eight years later, yeah. I was you're like... You're a late bloomer. Like, so I was a really late bloomer. So like for me... Also, you were like, yeah, you were kind of, you know, like... Well, my not sexuality bi wasn't... It was. Ex yeah, like my, it just came on when you were pretty much associated to me before I'd even worked it out for myself. Oh, because, uh, because you people sound, yeah, were like, already like, well, you're, you're gay. gay. Yeah. And I was not either way. Like, I didn't have a sexual opinion Preference. about either or. Yeah. Michael comes to the diary room to discuss his thoughts on new housemate Ray. I already know his deal to, to an extent. Um. I remember getting outside of my room. And I know, I, can, I, can, I can't really put it into words, but he... I just think he's lying about something or he's hiding something. I just get, I just get that feeling. I don't think he's a vet. Because he's like, yeah, animal doctor, I'm an animal's vet. And I'm just like, are you a vet or are you not a vet? I don't, I don't get it. Uh, and he could be. He's probably a vet. I have no idea. He just seems like maybe he's a vet's nurse or something and he's not quite a vet, but he's just saying he's a vet. Which is fine, you can do that. But I just feel like he's hiding something. I'm gonna look like a sap. I've got a photo of me and mum, and then I've got a photo uh, of my dog and another dog. Whose dog? My dog. A dog and another dog. Oh, my other dog, my first ever so dog. So you've got two photos. Two dog photos. Uh, oh, two dog photos. <laughs> two dog photos, and the other one's my mum. Uh, like... Stella? Just been yeah. Oh, you're Stacy. Smell my neck. Try and resist. Are you a horse? That's Old Spice. <laughs> I'm on a horse. Excuse me. Can yeah. you give me, can you give me a huge favour? No one's ever kissed him before. Can you just get it over and done with right no. now? No! It's not it's not can you? Can you? We're doing it Saturday. We're gonna, we're gonna do... Yeah. I think this should happen now. Look. <laughs> <laughs> I think this should happen now. No. Seriously, don't get up and leave him. I've got limbo. I'm so sorry to do that to you, by the way. Yeah. He wants to sell. Estelle. Hey, Slay. Can you do us a huge favour? I'm not smooching nobody. Come on! No. I think we all give him a smooch on his birthday. I'm really, really not liking all these little eye protectors you guys have. Yeah, that's what I said. I didn't even think of that. Super jelly, dude. Yeah. <laughs> you come here. I'll, you spin me. I'll spin you right around. So we count it out 30 times. Go quick. One, 
Two. Oh no. Three. It's like a paranoid already. Four. Five. Six. Four. Seven. Eight. It's back. 30. Oh, my kids. <laughs> After about six, I was gone, mate. Nine, Nine newbies. Night. Good night, newbies. It was lovely to make your acquaintance. Tomorrow night on Big Brother, the first weekly task goes in. Keeping housemates on their toes. But okay, Big Brother, we get it. All hail, Big Brother. I was like, oh. <laughs> oh. dude, you're gonna get yourself in so much in here. Coming up, the final housemate reveal. Oh, oh, he's so cute. He is. Yes. Yeah. I'm back at the house with the 14th and final housemate. So let's find out all about him. So, my friends would say that I was incredibly opinionated. I'm the bitchiest person you'll probably ever meet. <laughs> I tell people secrets. And I hate people that when you're telling stories, they've got a me too story. But I am that person because most of the time, it's actually happened to me. But it's so important to be happy and it's very easy to be upset and it's very easy to be sad, but it's more important to find yourself. If I don't like someone, they will know pretty much straight away about how much I hate them, unless I don't want them to know and I'm manipulating them. <laughs> I don't like people that are liars either, so I think it's important for me to be as honest and as real as I possibly can. So you spend all day, you're an account manager, you're on the phone, how's yeah. it been not having a phone to um, even talk to people and how will you go in the house with no phone? Oh. Uh, I'm actually looking forward to not making any calls for work. Having a little time off. Enjoying the break. Well, how, how much of a break do you think you'll have? How long do you think you'll be in the house? Uh, judging by how much I don't know right now and how much I haven't known for the last 10 days, mm -hmm. I'm going to say I know nothing. This is the most amount of nothing I've ever known. Right. <laughs> Good. Excellent. We've achieved something there, haven't we? The most amount of nothing. Yeah. So, your secret. What yeah. is it? Uh, I can't tell you. I can't tell anyone. All right, good. You passed that test, so yep. I guess you can go into the house. <gasps> Do you want to go? In? I'm excited. Yeah. Thank, <laughs> Thank you so much. Good luck. See you later. Bye. Bye. Last housemate gone. Ben, Michael, nice to meet you, dude. Nice to meet you. Hi. Hey, how you going, oh, mate? Got a bit oh, excellent. Our little family's complete. Oh, oh, I haven't had a girlfriend since I was 11. Oh. Oh. Obviously, you're the youngest person here. I am the youngest. I'm 18. Yeah. Oh, my God. How old are you? Um, oh. A perfect opportunity for Sarah to test George and Ryan on their secret. It's Alfie and Fred. I mean, they come down and we have to feed them. I see now, I see. I'm pretty happy with you said there were birds in here. I was like looking, I was like... Oh, no, it was a good joke though, because you were like the other <laughs> I birds. Reckon, hey, I wouldn't mind seeing the birds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I hate birds. Do you? I understand. Why I do you? Birds. Is there a reason? That's, oh, I can't stand birds. Why? I don't like them. That's one of my biggest like, phobias I fear is birds. Really? Yeah. Because I, I don't know why, it sounds stupid, right? But just Chips. the beak, and like they can sense my fear, and just... Gosh! Like, like, really? Just, yeah, don't like them. Okay. There you go. Do you know? Yeah. Um, no, nothing, nothing. You can tell me, Ryan. 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 <laughs> I did oh, make up that we had to I feed the birds. You, Ryan, Ryan, Ryan. I did make up we had to feed birds. I was just saying I don't like birds. Why? Like, they feed the top. Why? <laughs> Why? I just anything with actual two legs is fine, but just yeah. like yeah. <laughs> I think 
Estelle that I should have a pair of your shoes on. Bradley has befriended Estelle and is spending a lot of time with her. I really think this Pine look action. is like Pine working action. for me. Pine action. Higher. Higher. Yeah. Oh. That, you were, whoa, that was good. Yeah. I'm going to go to the bathroom. So we're going to need to go to the bathroom? I'm going to the toilet too. Okay. Cool. Damn. Um, I'm just cruising. For a bruising. <laughs> <laughs> you and Bradley are the cutest little friends. Isn't he the sweetest? Isn't he? He's so sweet. He's so smart. Just be careful though. Oh, really? No. Well, no, I'm just saying. See, see. Like you, you, wait, just. Talk to me. There's nothing. No, I. Is, is there I want anything? Him to, I, no, I just want, okay. him to, I want him to feel comfortable. No, and no, I know no, that I'm he feels saying, comfortable like, talking I'm, to me. I'm just thinking out loud. Do it. Um, if I was to think out loud, it would be. Continue to think out he's, loud. Well, I'm he's, he's young, he's yes. a virgin. Yes. And he's he's looking for his place to fit in and everything, which is great. So no, 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 which is great because you got this great friendship, mm. but you just need to reiterate. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Friends, yeah, yeah fist pump. I think yeah, tomorrow friends. if it can, if it can, if he. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This um, is Big Brother. No, it isn't. Who is it? If Female it's... housemates to the parlor. Oh! The parlor is the only place that girls can discuss the boys' secrets. It's like a girly room. Hey, you figured one out, <laughs> didn't you? I cannot believe it. Estelle. He admitted to being scared it's of birds. No, I reckon that's a playoff. Do you because he's, he's still the no, 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 I reckon it's true because he went and talked to Big Brother after he dropped it, really. No, nah, he's not. No, he did it. Yeah, me too. No, I don't reckon he's. I reckon he's still the 100 women. He's still in the bird thing to show it off. Look at Brad getting ready. A call to the parlour can also mean another ha- You can. Sing what Fantastic. you can say. Fantastic. No, but it's okay, I'm going to pass it on. <laughs> I just want to say, George, he's definitely not a millionaire because he works for a company as an electrician. Ah, yeah. oh, wait, wait, wait. Electricians in the mines, if he's been working there four years, he could have made a million dollars. That's if he hadn't spent a, a penny mm -hmm. in a day. And not over. They make and up to 400 over. grand a year. Yeah? But that, no. so... Basically, you would have to spend nothing. Go. I think he's dated a lot of women. Go. Yeah. Who do you reckon Joshua hates? Who do I think's the hottest? Uh, it's weird. Huh? I might go to Angie because I reckon she's just rock. Sarah's pretty attractive. Yeah. Sarah's hot. Yeah, I think Sarah's a bit of a bad. But like, too. Sarah looks exactly like my. Is that the cowboy hat one? Yeah. yeah. She's got a boyfriend though. Yeah. Oh, actually, I didn't know that. Do you think, given that Ryan is a model, the polar opposite is him having an IQ of a genius, considering he's done a law degree, commerce degree? Yeah, no. He's done a commerce and law degree. No, he's the bird boy. And he likes to watch me exercise. <laughs> Are we sure he's the bird boy? At the same time, I'm, like, I'm doing a double major in a degree and I'm not a genius, and I think... I think at the end of the day, anyone can do a degree. Yeah. Um, you know, he's he's a model, et cetera, et cetera. He's already said he has a phobia of beds. I'm guessing he's the one, but yeah. let's just play it out and yeah. see if anyone else. Whatever you do in life, it's just a pursuit of getting a girl <laughs> and finding a more attractive one. That's basically it. It's like, why did you get a job in law? It's like, well, you hear tricks like money. And <laughs> I have no much Ryan is like a proper English lad to me. Like, he reminds me of an English lad. He's a lad. Like, He's like a proper English really? lad. He's a yeah, lad. He yeah, he's an English He lad. reminds me of an English That's why I'm like, oh, oh, I just talked to him because he reminds me of it because he, like, you might think he's like touchy feely or whatever, but lads in England are just like, oh, yeah. yeah. Come on, darling. That's so, sorry, can I say something? Let her go. Let's let her go. What I was going to say is that I hope George is the one who's dated more than 100 women because I would like to be 101. Oh. <laughs> Coming up. Are you nervous? Oh, that's all I've been thinking about. Hey, I'm just trying to work it out in my head. Sonia sneaks into the house to send in housemate number 13. I'm in the camera run with housemate number 13. So let's find out a little bit more about him. If I set a goal, I stick with it. One of my goals is to get on Big Brother. Look at me right now. I can't think of a single goal that I haven't achieved. Being a vet is great. It's extremely stressful, but I'm constantly busy. I don't take lunch breaks. I just work, 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 work. 
I'm looking forward to Big Brother because it's going to be it's like rehab for a worker for you know. I like to be very assertive. I pull somebody aside. I say, this is what you're doing. This is why you're in the wrong and why I'm in the right and this is why it needs to stop. No. Outside of the Big Brother house, it usually ends in this. Inside the Big Brother house, God knows. <laughs> very nice. Being a perfectionist isn't easy. And here he is. Now, Ray, you've been in lockdown. Mm. You don't know who's gone into the house or what they've been up to. Does that make you nervous? Uh, I'm a little bit anxious about it. It's definitely making me go stir crazy, so. Well, you know, they have been forming some friendships mm. in there. Does that worry you? Uh, yeah, it's gonna be a bit of a challenge, but I'm definitely confident enough to step up to it. Well, hopefully you'll make some new friends in there. Yeah. Time to go. All right, cheers. Good, good luck. Thank you. Good luck. We'll be watching. Okay. Shh. <laughs> Michael, that's Tell the bedroom. Hey guys, yeah. sorry I'm late. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> He's a genius. Millionaire. 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 Oh, he's yummy. What? Oh, Jesus. Hallelujah. Give me some love. How are you, dude? Very good, mate. Very good. What's up? How are you, brother? I'm Bradley. Bradley, lovely to meet you, mate. How about Ryan? Ryan, nice love you, mate. Huh? Yeah, George. George. Nice hair, bro. Hey, mate. Josh. <laughs> Where are all the chicks at? Tell me. They're in the parlour, bro. Oh, okay, that's cool. Oh, millionaire. He's so cocky. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So yeah. millionaire. So cocky. We got some drinks. What's going on? No, no drinks. What are you doing for work, No drinks. Really? Okay, that's cool. Vet. Vet? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's either, no, you know what, he's either IQ or millionaire because nah. he's talking down. He's talking There's no down. way that he's a hundred women. He's but a jerk cannot date a hundred women. It's a big vet. Yeah, yeah, so this is a bit different for me. You, what, you can care about the Mexican, fish. Mexican, fish in the Mexican house. Yeah, oh, fish, yeah, so that's fish. all. Yeah, what we think is a puffer fish. An aquarium? Yeah, it's a aquarium. Show it to me. Come on, Ray. Can you tell us what type of fish it is? Yeah, can you tell you us? Know, I'm just you know gonna go with puffer fish on this one. Yeah, boy. Tetradont, we'll call it a tetradont. What's a scientific name? Tetradont. 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 I've done a bit of biology. Did you? <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, please don't disprove me on that one. I think it's a tetradont. Uh, he could be a juvenile defender. He could yeah, be. Because it's completely the opposite to what he looks like. This so, is wait, so, so awesome. So, how many years did you have to study to become a vet? Uh, six long. I did like a year to upgrade. How many years did you have to study to become a model? <laughs> Mate, this what's is going on here. Kitchen. Those. Kitchen. I'm so glad that's caught off. <laughs> There's no chocolate milk. Oh, no. Awesome. Yeah. Oh! Oh! Yes, do not he just slammed the fridge. Do not put your Why hands on our leader? fridge. Get your fingers off our fridge. Yeah, I yeah, want chocolate stressed. milk. I'll do anything for it. Oh. Mm -hmm. yeah. He's big brother. Oh, Female housemates. Your time in the parlour oh. is up. Thanks, Big Brother. Thank you. Walk out again slowly because I start to. He looks like he's gonna oh, spit it. Oh, he's gonna crack. He's gonna crack. Look at him. He looks so happy. Oh, oh no! Yeah, yeah. Oh, Why would you do that? Give it to me, Big Brother. Just do it. No, don't do that. You've already done like thirty. <laughs> you just keep going. I was up to twenty. I couldn't do it. I'm doing my head. Just keep going. No. What? He'll give me this one. I don't think he will, Ray. Uh, just do it, man. You know he's not going to talk to you until you do the 50 line. I, just, I did it. That's oh. what he asked me to do. No. He's not going to say just, anything. Just, he's not going to answer you. You're just sitting there all night. Wait it out, Ray. Wait it out. Be strong, brother. Solidarity. Be strong, man. Oh, Unity. Ray. You can do it. Or don't, yeah, no don't buckle, yes, Ray. Don't buckle. Don't buckle, don't buckle right. to the man, Ray. Right. I reckon you've got to ride it. All right, let's get serious. Radio. Won't admit when he's wrong. Hmm? What are we thinking? About what? Just the dynamico. Yeah, I, I feel Too like early to tell, Doc. Yeah, I think, I don't know, Ray's coming with a, bit, a little bit of something to prove. He walked in with swag, eh? Yeah, he walked in, he's like, sorry, I'm late, boys. Oh, really? And I was like, I'm just so tired really? by this point. I'm just like, hey. Did man. he actually, was that his opening line? Yeah. Oh, wow. Hey, Ray. Hey, 
Are you done? You done, right? It's all good. This I... is Big Brother. Oh, wait, oh, let's have to look a little bit for him. Ray. Yes. Your penmanship is borderline illegible. Ah! Where's Michael? I gave him my best shot. He's a vet. However, <laughs> on this occasion, mm. Big Brother is satisfied. Thank you, Big Brother. You may leave the naughty corner. Okay. That is all. Thank you. Did you hear? I heard so, what Big Brother said. No. I know this is passing judgment. I've tried not to, but like, he comes out. Yeah. Ray, okay, so Ray, Ray comes out. And um, they go, oh, you know, what did you say? And he goes, oh, I can't even remember. And I said, oh, no, you can remember. You just don't want to repeat it. And he goes, well, look, it really wasn't that bad. Bit, an, bit of an overreaction. But, OK, Big Brother, we get it. All hail, Big Brother. I was like, oh. <laughs> like oh. dude, you're going to get yourself in so much in here. Coming up, the final housemate reveal. Oh, oh he's so cute! Like turned gay. I'm a turned gay. I was always gay. You're always gay, but you were with women. Yeah. So was there, you know, like a point when you're like that girl was so wrong, and then like turned to a guy. Like was there this like you know like a girl that like turned you completely? And I'm gonna just made say. Be like, remember when you're 18? I didn't go through puberty until I was 18. Really? 11. So when I was 18. I yeah. 11. Like Beard. Hair. Hi. 13. I was 18. So eight years later. Yeah. I was You're like, a late bloomer. Like, so I was a really late bloomer. So, like, for me. Oh, so you were like, yeah, you were kind of, you know, like. Well, my not sexuality bi wasn't. Was yeah, like, my, it just came out when you were 18. My sexuality was pretty much associated to me before I'd even worked it out for myself. Oh, because, because you people sound. People yeah, were like, already like, well, you're, you're gay. gay. Yeah. And I was not either way. Like, I didn't have a sexual opinion Preference. about either or. Yeah. Michael comes to the diary room to discuss his thoughts on new housemate Ray. I already know his deal to, to an extent. Um, Look, I remember getting outside of my room. And I know, I, can, I, can, I can't really put it into words, but he... I just think he's lying about something or he's hiding something. I just get, I just get that feeling. I don't think he's a vet. Because he's like, yeah, animal doctor, I'm an animal's vet. And I'm just like, are you a vet or are you not a vet? I don't, I don't get it. Uh, and he could be. He's probably a vet. I have no idea. He just seems like... Maybe he's a vet's nurse or something, and he's not quite a vet, but he's just saying he's a vet, which is fine. You can do that. But I just feel like he's hiding something. I'm gonna look like a sap. I've got a photo of me and mum, and then I've got a photo uh, of my dog and another dog. Whose dog? My dog. A dog and another dog. Oh, my other dog, my first ever so dog. So you've got two photos. Two dog photos. Uh, oh, two dog photos. <laughs> two dog photos and the other one's my mum. It's uh, like... Stella? Who are you? Yeah. Oh, you're Stacy. Smell my neck. Try and resist. Are you a horse? That's Old Spice. <laughs> I'm on a horse. Excuse me. Can yeah. you give me a, yeah. a huge favour? No one's ever kissed him before. Can you just get it over and done with right no. now? No! It's not sexual. Can you? Birthday. We're birthday doing a Saturday. We're gonna, we're gonna do. Yeah. I think this should happen now. Look. <laughs> I think this should happen now. <laughs> Seriously, don't get up and leave him. I've got limbo. I'm so sorry to do that to you, by the way. Yeah. He wants a cell. A cell. Can you do us a huge favour? I'm not smooching nobody. Come on. I think we all give him a smooch on his birthday. I'm really, really not liking all these little eye protectors you guys have. Yeah, that's what I said. I didn't even think of that. Super jelly, dude. <laughs> when you leave the diary room, you're to go immediately to the naughty corner for calling Big Brother a naughty name. Okay, cool. Your housemates will show you where it is. Cool. That is all. Uh, what about the beer? No? Okay, cool. Ray Ray's been sent to the naughty corner! It's lit up! So what happens? I don't know! Uh, you said go to the naughty corner. Go stand next to the door! Okay. So what do I have to do? Just stand there. You two are going to be best friends. What happened? Ray, 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 Ray,
Right, right. It was personal. Right, right. Michael and Ray are going to get on just fine. <laughs> he got uh, he asked for a beer and got sent to the naughty corner. It's ridiculous. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, Ray, you must write the line, I must not call big brother naughty names 50 times on the blackboard. You may not leave the naughty corner until big brother is satisfied. That is all. I must not call big brother. This is Big Brother. Michael, you should have your microphone around your neck, not fellow housemates. He got too excited, he got so excited. He lucky he was standing really close to you. He's going to get in trouble as well. He's definitely going to get in trouble for that. Did he say anything after I ran off? Michael, as the naughty corner is in use, <laughs> drop and give Big Brother 50 push ups yeah! in the lounge. Do you feel like um, dynamics going to change a bit? Yeah, yes. big time. But George would fit in naturally. He's so lovely. Yeah. Oh, that's George would be so, so cool lovely. and relaxed. Straight up, George would be so, so cool. Lovely. But I feel like I sort of have to be on my guard a little bit with Ryan. Well, what's the other guys? And, you got, and, you seriously got rattled by oh, Ray. Right, Ray, Ray. Oh, Ray. I think really? we really have to be really tight. Touch your own Ray, because he, like, I don't, I don't think, I we think need to make Ray's going to be really all interesting. I'm saying is I haven't made any assumptions, but all it, I'm saying is straight away, I said, I'm not sure about Ryan, I'm not sure about Ray, but straight up, George could slip in and you wouldn't He's even so notice. He's so chill. Yeah. I sat there and told a joke, give him like, I would have been yeah. like way embarrassed away. It's all right. Can we kiss and make up? I'm so sorry that I called you a bogan. <laughs> it's all right, I'm just like the anti-bogan. I'm like, oh God. No, 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 look, can I just say, sometimes I was just explaining this before, when I'm in a situation that, when I'm a bit anxious, and I don't- Yeah, you must've been pretty Then I, When anxious, I walked yeah. in, everything about me was about me being gay when I first walked in. I didn't want to make and that, I, I didn't say anything. No, 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 I, I'm certainly not saying that to you, but I'm just saying like, for me, I, can imagine I consider be being gay about the fifth and the sixth thing that's interesting about me. But then I found that it was interesting oh, that I was living up to it. I said the overalls first. Yeah, the overalls. Yeah, I was like, there's a guy in overalls. That's the first, obviously. <laughs> well, please accept my No, apology. that's okay, I was just a little, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh man, it cut me deep. Cause she's like, you know what, it's okay, so it's all right. Coming up, Michael's suspicions about one of the new housemates. I just think he's lying about something or he's hiding something. I just get, I just get that feeling. Tonight's Big Brother, brought to you by the Holden Cruise, the only small car built in Australia. This is Big Brother. Is it Sassy Boy? George and Benjamin to the diary room. You're gonna get your luggage, you're gonna get Let's your luggage. Maybe, maybe. The four new male housemates haven't yet been given their luggage, which had to be checked by Big Brother. Housemates. Hello? As you can see, Big Brother has provided your luggage. We can see that, yes. You're free to take this inside the house. Could you take your fellow housemates' luggage inside as well, please? Sure. No worries. Have you felt welcomed? Yeah, definitely. I felt welcomed. I'm, I think at the moment it seems like we're all really big, happy families. I think it's going to be interesting to watch that dynamic change. I can already tell from some of the people that I've met that they're going to get on my nerves a little bit. So, I don't know. 
some of the girls are like staring at me or treating me like a bit of a novelty. And that's, I don't know, I don't know. It's foreign to sort of be treated like a, an accessory or like that these people know who I am just based on the fact that I'm a bit shiny and gay. And Big Brother requested you not to refer to him as anything other than Big Brother. However, yeah. you then left the diary room and referred to Big Brother using a naughty name. Ah, uh, I gotta get used to the fact you got cameras everywhere. <laughs> I apologize, I'm sorry. I, um, yeah, we got off on the wrong foot. I don't wanna have a bad relationship with you, Big Brother. I'm all into the bromance, so uh, look, I apologize. If I could please have a beer, that'd be fantastic. You know, I really wanna just crack a beer with these guys. They seem like heaps of fun and I'd love to just have a beer with them. Yeah, and I'll, I'll refer to you as Big Brother. I'll give you the respect that you warrant. If you give me a beer. That is unfortunate. Ray, when you leave the diary room, you're to go immediately to the naughty corner for calling Big Brother a naughty name. Okay, cool. Your housemates will show you where it is. Cool. That is all. Uh, what about the beer? No? Okay, cool. Ray Ray's been sent to the naughty corner. It's lit up. So what happens? I don't know. Uh, you said go to the naughty corner. Go stand next to the door. Okay. So what do I have to do? Just stand there. You two are going to be best friends. What happened? Ray, 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 Ray. It was personal. <laughs> Michael and Ray are gonna get on just fine. <laughs> he got uh, he got asked for a beer and got sent to the naughty corner. It's ridiculous. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Ray, you must write the line. I must not call Big Brother naughty names fifty times on the blackboard. <laughs> You may not leave the naughty corner until Big Brother is satisfied. <laughs> that is all. I must not call Big Brother. This is Big Brother. Michael, <laughs> you should have your microphone around your neck, not fellow housemates. <laughs> Close to he's going to get in trouble as well. Yeah, yes. so he's definitely going to get in trouble for that. <laughs>